Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to MPG and today's gonna be an update on my overwinter garden. But first, I wanna share this amazing video, this amazing sight right here in the mountains in LA. Just look at that. I'm on top of the mountain right now. All the way out there, that's the San Pedro area. Well, you have downtown LA. Straight ahead over there is a the Hollywood sign. I don't know if you guys can see that. But just look how amazing, amazing this view is. And as you all know, as you guys can see, it's a beautiful day today in LA. Look at that. Just amazing. I mean, it's been raining like crazy over here. Now we have sunny sky blue skies. This is what it's all about, guys. Come up here and relax, clear my mind, and just get away from everything that's going on in this world. All this bad political stuff that's going on. And I mean, it's just, this is what you call your chi. <laughs> <laughs> well gardening is my chief but just this view this hike this it's unbelievable unbelievable just look at this I just wanted to share this all with with all my viewers all my supporters all my subscribers just just look at that how beautiful downtown skyline is And I'll be going up to that mountain real soon as well. So I'll be showing you guys uh, the site, the view from over there. Overlooks all of LA, all around LA County. Isn't it amazing, guys? If you guys have a view like this or something, please share with us all. Uh, we would all love to see this. And please uh, let us know how your how the experience was. It took me like 10 minutes to get up here, guys. <laughs> it was a nice little workout. <laughs> but look at this, guys. Amazing, isn't it? This is what it's all about, guys. After a long week of work, just come up here and relax. Just relax. Look how quiet it is. Just nice. All right, guys. Well, uh, I'm going to get back to my garden and show you guys what I'm doing down there. All right? Give me a sec. Well, since I'm walking down over here, I just wanted to share with you guys that, you know, why I garden and what do i get out of it why do i do it how do, you know how do i have time to you know do that in between my hectic schedule that i have well wrong guys it's this you know just to relax like i said get away from everything that's going on and all the bad things that's going on around the world you know i don't want to be turning on the news and hearing bad things going on around this world i just don't want to hear that just want to be one with mother nature like this and just relax you know you know what why do you guys garden you know i want to know why you guys do it what do you guys get out of it you know because me i know for one it brings me happiness you know and growing up in growing up here in la i mean it's just a busy lifestyle you know yeah like i said it's a passion of mine i just love doing it and i love sharing with everybody love sharing everything with all my viewers all my supporters you know because like i said you guys are what's making this happen you guys are the reason why npg is up on youtube like i said the more support i get the more encouragement i get to do all these amazing footages and just to spread my knowledge around so everybody, all everybody, can have a successful growing season. You know, that's all I want to see this summer. I want to see amazing accomplishments. You know, 
Like I said, there shouldn't be any secrets to gardening. There shouldn't be any secrets to anything. Just grow. If everybody knew how to do that, I'm sure everybody would have a great time. You know? I mean, this is why I do it. This is why. It's amazing. It's beautiful, right? So yeah. <laughs> I'm a little aired out right now. I'm a little it's been a while since I've worked out. <laughs> but yeah, I mean it's it's this is awesome, guys. I mean it's a nice little hike. And like I said, we'll be making a trip up there where you're able to oversee all of LA. So yeah guys, this year we're gonna be doing it big. We're gonna have a bunch of plants out here. A bunch of amazing rare exotic varieties and some of my own crosses guys and I'm definitely gonna be happy to share all that with you so yeah so uh let me uh get back to you guys when I'm back down in my garden I have a little climbing to do down <laughs> so uh, give me a second all right guys all right guys we made it back to the bottom of the mountains trail where it's actually where I have access to my garden <laughs> <laughs> but look at all of this look at those aloe vera plants and those nopales unbelievable so let me show you what i got going on over here so as you can see i moved all my overwinter garden back here on the trail we did a little couple of uh trimmings down here and accidentally i whacked one of my carolina reapers and uh there she, there she is Let's see if she bounces back, guys. You know, like I said, pepper plants don't like to give up. <laughs> they keep going. So, uh, this one, I gave everybody a haircut. I gave, I trimmed every, all the plants up. And I had a question, what is all these leaves? What is all this stuff doing here? Well, this is what I'm calling. Well, this is what, why I do it. I compost on my soil. Why do I do that? Well, the worms down here, all this life that's going on down there, I don't know if you guys can see that, is breaking down all of this, making nutrients for my plants, revitalizing my soil. Like I said, this is what Mother Nature does. You know, this is what she does. Leaves fall from the trees, they break down around the plant, uh, around the tree. It makes nutrients okay guys these worms these little farmers that i have here these little red wigglers are just munching and breaking everything down over here and it's turning into this black gold that you guys see look at that look at all that dead organic matter why i do this i don't have to go and buy another bag of compost or another bag of soil i'm doing it here right here in my pots right here magic is happening mother nature is happening everything is being broken down to make i'm oh, sorry guys <laughs> i'm getting excited over here <laughs> everything is being broken down here everything and it's making black gold which is going to be tremendous for my plants and you'll see how they bounce bounce back they're a little yellowed right now they're a little beat up but it's because it's been cold. But everything will be flourishing once again. So we got a Carolina Reaper there, another Carolina Reaper there. In front of it is a Chile de Arbol. I have those uh, cinder blocks right there because uh, they're two gallon smart pots and uh, they're a little top heavy. So I don't want the wind to be knocking them down. So just for now, until I transplant. Picked up a bit, guys. Here's my uh, Indian carbon boot, tall plant. Like I said, I'm 6'2", guys. She's a beautiful plant. Very prolific. She produced thousands of pots for me. Thousands. And as you can see, there's aggressive toppings going on. Aggressive. Uh, I've trained these plants quite nice. And that's what I want to see you guys do. My black boot. Some of you that, know, that don't know about this plant. They have uh, black stems, black stalks. 
the leaves yes are yellow right now <laughs> obviously <laughs> but they have very heavy tints of purple in the leaves which is a beautiful plant and the color transition these peppers go through is unbelievable unbelievable check out my cpr plant talk about aggressive trimming and look how tall she is six two indefinitely she'll be blowing up this summer too <laughs> She didn't give me desirable phenols this uh, season that passed, but I'm pretty sure she'll be kicking out a good uh, couple of phenols for me. Good, nice, good looking pots. As you can see, I took down my hydroponic setup and I'll be showing you guys why I did that. Big things guys, big things. But these are my reservoirs. I took out the pumps already, cleaned them out, but you guys will see. All of this, one side here, one side there, full of plants. And best believe I'll be throwing some up there in Mother Nature and let her take care of it. Like I did with these three. This one over here, they've been hungry, so uh, um, I might say they're not doing so good, those two. This one as well, as you can see. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure they'll bounce back if anything, but if not, you know, like I said, it's just a test. You know, see if they will or not. If they pull through, it, awesome. If they don't, you know, it wasn't meant to be. <laughs> but I have, uh, I have high hopes for them. So yeah, guys, if you guys have, uh, have done that, or I mean, this is what I want. <clears throat> Tell me why you guys garden. Why do you guys do it? You know, what do you guys get out of it? You know? You know, for me, I love it. You know, it's a passion of mine. It grew into a passion, and I love it. If you guys have amazing sites like that, like I had up there, just overview all of LA, please share that with all of us. That will be cool. <laughs> Definitely. And, uh, <clears throat> so, yeah, guys, that's that. I want to wish you guys a good day. You guys have a great day, and uh, if you guys haven't liked this video, Please like the video. If you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Take care.